simplify cos theta of cos theta sin theta minus sin theta cos theta plus sin theta times sin theta minus cos theta cos theta and sin theta. So here it's a two by two matrix. So let's consider cos theta times cos theta sin theta and minus sin theta and cos theta. So by scalar multiplication we can use cos theta is multiplied to each and every element of the matrix. So we can write cos theta into cos theta. So we can write cos square theta. Cos theta into sin theta is cos theta sin theta. And cos theta into minus sin theta is minus cos theta sin theta. And cos theta into cos theta is cos square theta. So keep it aside 1. And now consider sin theta times sin theta minus cos theta and cos theta and sin theta. So which is equal to now let us multiply again sin theta into sin theta is sin square theta. Sin theta into minus cos theta is minus cos theta sin theta. And sin theta into cos theta is sin theta cos theta. And sin theta into sin theta is sin square theta. Now adding 1 and 2. So we will get cos square theta plus sin square theta corresponding elements to be added. Both the matrices are 2 by 2 so we can add the matrices corresponding elements to be added. So next cos theta sin theta minus sin theta cos theta. Next again minus cos theta sin theta plus sin theta cos theta. And again cos square theta plus sin square theta. So on simplifying you will get cos square theta plus sin square theta from an identity. We can say it is 1 since cos square theta plus sin square theta is equal to 1 by using trigonometric identity. So we can state here the first element it is 1 and cos theta sin theta minus sin theta cos theta gets cancelled. So we can say 0 and again sin theta cos theta minus cos theta sin theta will be 0. And again by using the identity cos square theta plus sin square theta is 1. So we got an identity matrix of order 2. So we can say I2. Okay. Thank you.